scooting around Coral Gables just got a whole lot easier and fun. The city has introduced a scooter share program that allows residents and visitors to rent one of a fleet of electric scooters conveniently placed throughout the downtown area. The service is provided by San Francisco-based company Spin, who seeks to provide more affordable and sustainable transportation options. City commissioners have entered into an agreement with Spin to introduce these scooters during a one-month trial period throughout August, making Coral Gables the first city in Florida to pilot an innovative scooter share program. Yeah, so Spin just likes or wants to provide a secondary service, uh, mobility service for residents and people alike, uh, aside from a car, to, to get from point A to point B. Uh, mostly electric now. Uh, we did bikes from the, in the past, but now it's mostly electric vehicles, scooters, and e-bikes. Every car that you take off the road saves you know, a certain amount in carbon emissions, and that, that's what we're really striving to do, is to actually save the environment and just provide another sustainable way for people to get from point A to point B. The scooters are easy to use by simply downloading the Spin app and locating one that is available. Next, scan the barcode on the scooter with your mobile device and you're ready to go. Kicking off twice gets the scooter going, and after your ride is complete, you simply park it anywhere. The initial rental fee is only $1 and costs an additional 15 cents per minute. I think the Gables is a, a great community, you know, you have a great uh, business district, you have Miracle Mile, you have Geraldo that was just redone, uh, and you have a lot of different businesses and restaurants and activities to do. That's really the key footprint for, for something that, that's going to do well with a docking service. There are of course some rules that local law enforcement urges people to keep in mind, specifically where not to ride. Do not ride on sidewalks on Miracle Mile, sidewalks on Ponce de Leon Boulevard three blocks north and south of Miracle Mile, or through Geralda Plaza. All other sidewalks are allowed and preferred. Users must be at least 16 years old to ride, and although helmets are not required, they are certainly encouraged. Being safe, being cognizant of pedestrians while you're on the sidewalks is, is paramount. Um, we don't want to see anyone, whether you're operating one of these or whether you're walking on the sidewalk, get injured. Uh, please uh, be mindful and dismount the motor scooter if you are in a uh, if you are on a sidewalk that is heavily congested, the scooters can reach speeds of up to 15 miles an hour. And um, the, from the police department's perspective, we would like to see everyone utilize the safety options that are available in helmets and eye protection. Okay, so we've got our spin app open. We've located our scooter. Now it's just as easy as kicking off twice to get it started. For more information on how to ride safe, you can visit www.spin.pm or, of course, download the app on your mobile device. Now it's time for this reporter to scoot on out of here. I'm Adam Yogle for Coral Gables Television. <laughs>Be sure to follow us on Facebook.com slash City of Coral Gables and on Twitter at City Coral Gables. Also subscribe to our YouTube channel and e-news at enews at coralgables.com. And if you haven't already, download the Intelligent app.